There it goes. <clears throat> this is the last update for the truck vlogs for a very, very long time. <clears throat> I'm up here in Maine, got a boat loaded due to some delays that were no fault of mine or the people I work for. God, I look like a mess. Anywho, the Come on. The travel lift operator had to get a COVID test this morning because somebody he came in close contact with contracted the virus. So, we were delayed four hours for loading. I got here at quarter to seven. Didn't start loading until about 11 o'clock. People walking dogs out there. Anywho. <clears throat> So, by the time everything was all said and done, 11, got boat and everything tied down at about noon. So we maneuvered, tried, had to use the yard dog to get out of the yard, because it's very steep over there. Uh, we got a little stuck, so we got it unstuck. And then I was one. These guys are only supposed to work half a day until noon. But when your yard dog gets stuck on someone else's trailer, you work till it's out. So by the time two o'clock rolls around, everything's good, said, and done, and I'm ready to go. But we were not able to get an escort in time due to. A emergency situation involving an escort that we use already. He had to go do more important, and it's like I, I'm not saying more important things sarcastically. I've been there. I've like I was just off the past week for my girlfriend having spinal fusion surgery in her uh, cervical cervical vertebrae, life saving. So, but I posted about the delays and. The thing, me sitting here in a very nice Camden, Maine. It's great. I posted about it in a boat hauling group I am in on Facebook. Uh, today I learned my boss is also in that Facebook group. He wasn't mad about what I posted. Wasn't exactly happy about it because it makes it look like we weren't able to get an escort, even though we had one lined up three days ago, but A, he had to go do other things, and B, we didn't even know if I'd be able to load today if I were to get here on time with that guy being, get if he would have tested positive for COVID, there would have been nobody here to run the travel lift for quite a while. Definitely not until Monday, at the earliest. So I would have been here pretty much no matter what, if that had happened, but I don't mind sitting here till Monday. It's not a big deal. Like I said, the boss just said it doesn't, he thinks it doesn't look super great for us. So I had to delete the post. Now I know not to post anything in there. Unless it's just pictures of cool, cool stuff. But after that, ass chewing. Not really ass, it was ass chewing. I got, uh, as well as all of dispatch, which I feel bad about that. I, I it just sucks because I, I enjoy doing these videos, but for the time being, until I get my own truck, which I hope is within the next couple of years, because I'm trying. Um, I'll still work for this company because I love this company. But for the time being, I won't be doing any more videos. Just because I, I don't want to have these videos affect my job. 
these videos I'm doing for fun. I enjoy doing them. I, I love editing videos. I'm not that great at it, but I love editing videos. I love making them because it's just recording my daily, everyday, <laughs> everyday content. But uh, not if it's gonna screw with what I, the job that I need to support my family. Simple as that. So I'll still do project car stuff when I do project car stuff down. Uh, <clears throat> we're hoping to move down to Florida at the beginning of next year, end of this year, hopefully. Our apartment lease is up in October. We're hoping the new landlord we got a couple months ago doesn't jack up the rent crazy amounts because I'm the only one that's able to work in the household with girlfriend having her surgery and her health problems and you know the general public frowning on trying to get your one and a half year old to work you can build I'm gonna not <laughs> I'm gonna not say that joke <laughs> just we're just gonna let that one go anyway I'm the only one in the house able to work at the moment. So, <clears throat> so I got rid of my Ram, for those of you that remember the Ram. Traded that in for a Kia Sportage on lease, which will help her learn how to drive. Um, again, for those of you that don't know, she was hit by a vehicle about four or five years ago. Had to relearn how to walk and relearn how to do everything. Uh, sold my Honda. I don't need it anymore. Switch insurance companies, so it's cheaper. Um, I'm not really buying anything I don't need. <clears throat> and I got rid of a car that I was going to do more work to. Um, sold it, so I didn't do that anymore. This video is getting a lot longer and a lot more in depth than I originally thought. But yeah, long story short, due to backlash I have gotten from people that signed my paychecks and ensure that me and my family can live a pretty decent life, you know, and not live in a van down by the river. I am going to not completely stop making videos for the trucking. I've probably little shorts here and there if something happens. Not showing any info with the truck company or anything. Um, but I've taken the previous vlog is down just so I can not have to constantly think what's gonna happen if you know I know that's stupid and it's not really something that should be worried about but trucking's weird man I don't want to be treated differently because of the things that I say online you know and it's nothing even really that bad but oh, face it just you never know there's a lot of pauses in this video while I just contemplate existence that's about it so no more trucking videos for quite a while. I need a haircut really bad. I look like shit. But that's it for now. I'm gonna hang out in Camden, Maine here for the weekend. We got an escort coming Monday. I got a place down the road that's got real good locks bagel. Real good. Not not like New York quality good, but it's not bad. So <sighs> this is a goodbye for now, my friends. Thank you all who've been watching the videos. 
thank you for watching to the end of this one. If you did, we'll do more. Well, we'll get back to it. Thanks again.